What an amazing day. What an amazing day here in the tournament here in Dallas. I mean, an unbelievable 10 games. We're talking Lakers, Celtics, Ali Frazier, straight ripping and triggers down. Gentlemen, what did we just see? I mean, probably 10 of the most most unbelievable games in Halo 3. Well, I just think, you know, I think we see, have seen the development of a real rivalry here. A lot of people were ready to just give this event to Straight Riven. I think Triggers Down fought their way back. And you know what? I'm really happy to say that I have never, ever seen a finish like that at a playoff or any other tournament that we've run that just had me saying, what is going to happen next? I mean, I was excited. I almost threw my uh, head, head, headphones off and ran down there to <laughs> hug Carmen and everybody and congratulate him and to say I'm sorry to T-Square and those guys because that's some of the most amazing Halo I have ever seen, and I have seen a lot of Halo. Hands down, the best two matches of the season, and it all came in one championship match here at the Dallas Playoff. And what's so crazy about this is Triggers Down finished sixth in Toronto. They add Karma, they come in here more driven than ever, and they win this event. You know, they got to be feeling amazing going into Vegas. Yeah, I would definitely have to say they have Phil Hazen going into Vegas and taking that momentum with them to Vegas. We're going to take out a look at our final standings here in Dallas. We got Triggers down, taking the number one spot, straight ripping at two, and coming down in the bottom, we see Carbon and Legends at the bottom. But, gentlemen, looking at those standings and looking at the tournament today, what does that mean for our national championships in Vegas? Well, coming into Vegas now, you can see these qualified teams with their points. Triggers down did themselves a bit of a favor. They moved up to number two. Final boss is number three. Instinct, Classic, then Ambush, Carbon, and Legends. So that's who you're going to see in Vegas. Essentially, what Triggers Down did is they helped themselves out in the long run. They're going to have less of a road to have to go through. And of course, you got to give big props to Ambush this event. They finished in fourth for the second time in a row. And this time, they move up ahead of Carbon, moving into that sixth spot. And, and this is going to be a great great national championships in Las Vegas as we look forward to that November 21st through 23rd. Look at that winner's bracket right there. I mean, we got a lot of great matchups, gentlemen. Yeah, you know what? I think right now the thing I'm looking at right there, I'm looking at Final Boss Ambush. I think that could be really exciting. Obviously, Straight Legends is a rematch. I think Legends is going to want to get some revenge right there. And then Instinct is definitely going to want to get some revenge on Classic. And then at the bottom, don't sleep on Carbon. As we said, they had a good showing here. They definitely showed up and they pushed some people. So maybe they can do something. But the way Triggers Down just played, honestly, I don't know if I would want to be facing off against them in the first round. And when and Puckett... What else do you think is going to go down in Vegas? I mean, we got those top eight just like we had here. I mean, it's going to be a great, exciting tournament. Well, you know, it's Vegas. Everything on the line there. Seasons on the line. Of course, that's coming up November 21st through the 23rd. Have to do a quick correction there. Ambush got fifth last event, but they're second, fourth place over the course of the season. And that is the team I'm really excited about in Vegas. The young guys, they might be pulling some more upsets. And, of course, the two juggernauts that we've seen on the main stage tonight, that is a rematch that I'm most looking forward to. I hope it happens yeah. in Vegas. I got to tell you, honestly, real quickly before we're done here, if I had my druthers, I would love to see this kind of action. But for the national championship, I mean, I, you couldn't script it any better. But we're going to have to wait and see. That's why they play the games. There's eight ca capable teams in Vegas. But you know what? I guarantee you the energy and the action is going to be just as good. And there you go. That's why we play the game. The thrill of victory and the agony of defeat. We saw it all right here in Dallas. But we're gearing up for the national championships in Las Vegas, November 21st through the 23rd. That's the weekend before Happy Turkey Day. And we're going to say goodbye from here. Thanks to all our commentators, Chris Puckett, Sundance, our interviewer down on the floor next to you. I've been Farouk. This has been Championship Sunday. Thanks for all the production crew and everybody out there watching. We'll see you next time at the National Championships in Las Vegas. Love you, family.